What is going on on YouTube? Welcome back to the video. Today's video, we got ourselves a little pack opening because they just dropped a brand new strategy pack in the game, which a lot of people are doing to make coins. So, I'm going to break it down to you guys. We're going to do our pack opening, and you guys are going to see here is my like starting point so you guys know exactly how many cards I bought. So, in case we don't know, how much coins am I going to rip? I'm going to rip till I have 26 mil. So, I'm going to rip 500k into this brand new pack. As you guys will be seeing here, let's go over here. Check. The brand new pack what we got in store here for today is the brand new rare plus strategy pack. So I'm gonna rip roughly about to 500k in these packs, and we're gonna see our, how we do. Of course, there's no odds on this thing, so we're just gonna go ahead and rip and see exactly how good we do. Of course, there's a lot of ways to make a lot of your coins back once you rip these packs. Normally, every single time you rip the pack, you're gonna be losing at least 15k. But if you turn the blue ones into purple ones, that means you'll be losing about. 15k for two of them instead of 30k so right now say right I did rip these two packs I should have lost 30k but if I turn that to a purple one there's a good chance I lose 15k or less so that's what you need to do is to make them the purple one and the purple one we got here is scrambler don't care we're trying to pull the good the new ones which are gonna be ball hawk and route tech which are going for a shit in the coins right now so those two are the main goals we're trying to also tomorrow I'm going to be uploading a video trying to explain exactly how the strategy items work because I see a lot of people are still confused about them. Tomorrow's video, I'm going to break it down to make it simple as possible to understand. So keep stay tuned for that. So far, we, not got, we have not gotten a single legendary. So, you know, what else can you expect? These are very solid packs. A lot of blue ones. There is also, you guys should know, if you pull any purple ones and they have the arm, like a like an arm or like two, um, uh, oh, a legendary. Real in, then I actually go for something. I had to check that price. A legendary, it goes for 200k. Not bad, not bad at all. So, but if you pull, like, say, a purple one and it has like an arm on it, that's throw power. That one, and if you see like two people in there, I mean, that's throw power. Those are the most expensive, like, cards or like versions of the card. So, tomorrow's video, I'm gonna explain exactly how it is because some people are very confused and don't understand it. So, tomorrow's video, I'm gonna break it down simplest way possible so you guys can understand how season three strategy items work because it's a little bit confusing, but I understood I did a lot of research to understand it because I thought I knew understand it and I did more research and I completely understand it now. So, tomorrow's video, we're gonna do that. So, we're still ripping these packs, seeing how well we do. Of course, we need to pull at least 500k for us to make coins. Oh, Route Tree. Route Tree and it has arm. Oh, that may actually go for something. That may sell for something. That, because it has an arm. I'm going I'm to show you guys exactly. Tomorrow's video, we're going to explain everything so you guys don't get a little bit lost. But yeah, I tried these out packs earlier today when I was working. And they were pretty bad. I did pull three legendaries. But if I didn't pull those three legendaries, I would have lost a lot of coins. So that's something about that we're going to talk about. Tomorrow's we're going to explain exactly what you need to do. But so far, these packs earlier today were bad. So far today, I said we're doing pretty good. So far... So far, I'm probably gonna buy a lot of strategy items, but yeah. So we are up to 500k now. So let's head over to the item binder, and we are going to see exactly how much coins we made or lost. I believe we did pretty good because 200k for one of them and pretty much the rest of them were pretty good. So let's check exactly how much we would have made if we just quick some all. Of course, we're not gonna quick some all. We just want to check exactly how much we made. And if we quick sell all of them, we would have made 500k. So pretty much breaking even if we quick sell them. Now, if you do my trick method, I told you turn the blue ones into purple ones and sell those on the block. There's a good chance we made we made profit because we would have to check exactly every single purple one how much they go for, and that's pretty much it. That's a little method, guys. So in case you guys need to know, that is something you guys could do. And of course, you see this card is going for 200k, very expensive card, and a lot of these route tree ones are going for a lot of ones. So I would recommend turn our blue ones and our purple. As you guys see, we got one, we got five, six, seven, eight, nine. We got about 10 blue ones. Turn those 10 blue ones, we could turn those into, we turn those, all those blue ones into purple, which is two. So we got about 10 of them. 10 divided by two would be, um, we got five. So five times about 70K is how much they usually go for. Five times 70K should be about 350K plus two that, two, 350K, that's two, 350k, okay, plus 200, that's 500k. Plus, we got pulled two more purple ones. As you guys said, like roughly, you know, 600k. We still made a little bit of coins back. So, that's pretty much my math on it. 
Well, that's all. That's pretty much the video, guys. Hope you guys did enjoy the video. Make sure you hit the like button, subscribe down below. Let me know if you guys are excited for my breakdown of tomorrow's strategy cars video tomorrow. So once again, my name is Deadly, and I hope you all have an amazing day while I finish ripping these packs. And I.